First off, please remember to like, share, subscribe, or whatever it is you do, wherever you watch these little ditties. Thank you. <laughs> In this week's collaboration between Carl M. Jenks Poetry Corner and Bespoke Vocals, we have a challenge. The poem comes via the discovery by David R. Eubank of heretofore unknown tellings of fairy tales by famous poets and writers. This poem's source may be interiorly revealed, but its mysterious poet's identity must be pondered and thereby gleaned, so excogitate, apprehend, and perceive. The Gold Hair, discovered by Professor Eubank Dismounting, I tethered my steed, and beheld in the shadowy light, in the lowering, darksome light, a resplendent vision indeed, a maiden in rare damask dight, at the top of a tower, imprisoned she leaned out from a lofty casement, a hideous hag, weird and wizened, stood below, as it were, in the basement, what? A sight to bewail and bemoan, what a strangely incongruous pair, a beautiful beastly pair. Rapunzel, my sweet, quoth the crone, let down your golden hair. Methought that she uttered a trope, commanding the maid to confide, but no, in a trice like a rope, hair literally fell by her side. What transpired, I staunchly avouch. There was never an enterprise madder, more callous, more criminal madder. Heedless of many an ouch, the hag used the hair as a ladder. Could there be a more heinous abuse the memory still oppresses to put to inglorious use those glorious golden tresses? The Gold Hair, discovered by Professor Eubank. If you know the supposed writer of the poem, please put it in the comments. Thank you, Carl. Use the links to assist the ongoing humanitarian efforts in Ukraine, of course, and around the world. And I will see you soon.